Well, it's still raining in New York, but I need to make some photos. So today I am headed out to try and take you along with me and show you a couple of places to hopefully get some, some photos on a rainy day. It's, uh, it's tricky to shoot on a rainy day because obviously you want to protect your camera gear and you also don't want to get soaking wet and sick. So let's see what this day can bring. essentials for me. Of course, some waterproof shoes, an umbrella. So the thing about rainy day photography is sometimes there's nobody out to take photos of. Um, that guy playing the guitar is there pretty much every day and um, there are lots of photos of him on the internet. I will add mine to the, to the mix. After today, it was nice to kind of have the space to myself, just uh, him and I, but um, there was not a whole lot going on there. So I am on my way out of the park to try and find a little bit of shelter, but some maybe more populated places to catch people hiding from the rain or running from the rain or whatever. I think it's gonna rain for another maybe hour or two. It's not raining that hard, but it's hard enough to just kind of keep people off the streets and be annoying. So let's, uh, Let's see what I can find. Ha! I love the city. The city is so fucking nuts sometimes. It's raining and there's a guy just kicking a soccer ball, getting his exercise in. Rain be damned. That guy was awesome. He was like, win or lose, I got a game on Sunday. So number 10, God bless you. And then just kept on kicking. dry and find somewhere to duck in, uh, which I did, to Muji, I want some new gloves, which work on my touch screen, which is an upgrade. So I am uh, sheltering <laughs> at Grand Central Station right now, uh, I'm going to pull the camera back out and try and make some photos here, so let's see what I can get. some steam up here, which is very promising. So I'm headed that way to see if I can't get something interesting. Oh yeah, this, this is looking good. So what's happening behind me right now is like my dream my dream scenario for shooting street photography. You can see I'm, I'm totally covered in steam right now. I've got some like hyperactive steam vents at ground level, at foot level, as opposed to kind of up through these sort of diversions that they sometimes build. But when I see these, I just go nuts. I, I park it, I, I basically just like work that corner until I get the shot that I want. And on a day like today, when it's you know rainy and kind of gross, you get umbrellas and coats and hats, and it's a uh, super dramatic, amazing photo. So I'm super excited to have, to have found this today. Uh, it's 
getting a little bit wet again, but I, I'm pretty sure I just got the shot of the day. Super excited about that, so. Yeah, so anyway, I'm back in Grand Central. I'm super pumped about that photo that I that I made out there. I think that there are probably a couple of others in the set that I'm also psyched about, um, but we will see. Uh, the rain has kind of kicked back up, so I popped in here to just chill for a little bit. I'm popping downtown to meet a friend for coffee in like 90 minutes. So if the rain lines up a little bit, I may walk and see what else I can get. If not, subway.